Hello everyone, Mist here, or Nathan, whichever one you want to call me, or refer to me as, and this is episode 1 of Nukes and Moabs with Mist. So, today's episode is going to be on Model for 2 as you can see, and it's going to be obviously be a nuke. And if you did see, or if you didn't see, I'm not quite sure, but anyway, um, I'm accompanied today by my best mate LCL, as you just saw him right there, in the blue. <laughs> the little gremlin running, I don't know why I said that, but anyway. So, He's my best friend, we've been best mates for a long while, on Xbox and in real life, so we just decided to go for some nukes early in the morning, before everyone even got on Xbox, about, I'll say about 9-ish, 9-ish, 10. Anyway, I got two nukes that morning, so I'm going to use the second nuke as the second episode, and then hopefully get more out for the third episode. So that's the plan I'm going to go at for that three episode, for those three episodes. So today, I'm not sure what my KD was, but actually, dude, I think about three times until I actually get my streaks rolling and some of these gameplays will be a bit campish guys because I'm not the I'm not the Sandy Ravage of you know Modern Warfare 2 I'm not the Sandy Ravage of Modern Warfare 3 I don't even know if he plays Modern Warfare 3 for my abs but I know he's a tank on Xbox and I mean I mean Modern Warfare 2 because obviously he's on Xbox anyway so I'm not going to be as good as him but like if you're gonna expect that sort of gameplay, I'm sorry guys, but you're at the wrong place. Uh, not that like amazing sort of gameplay you'll see from me, like giving you tips on what you should do. But anyway, and that's all for that matter. So what I wanted to talk to people and to you guys basically um, about on this commentary was different social networking sites and how they can actually help you gain your views. I've talked about this on my first episode on Vestrum Games and which is also on my channel as well. It's a COD 4 gameplay on Overground. So if you want to just go check that out, which is my episode, well, my first episode, well, first commentary, I should say, on Vestrum, uh, that's, that will be on my channel and on Vestrum Games. So, social networking sites and how they can actually help you improve your view count, your fan base, and even your subscribers. So, here we go. I use Twitter now. Um, I was never a fan of Twitter, uh, I don't think I'll ever be a fan of Twitter, well, I think I might get into it a lot, but it depends, but at the moment, um, I'm enjoying it, but if anything goes bad, if I get some, like, I don't even know where I'm going with this, but anyway, um, I'm not the biggest Twitter fan, uh, I will get to love it, obviously, after a couple, a while, I should say, um, after a couple of weeks of using it, I'll get used to it, I'll get used to the flow of it, and that will lead on to that, so, I use Twitter now because it's pretty easy to speak to you guys if you want to get in touch with me or even if you just have a question for me because I will be start st <laughs> starting Q&A's um, after I reach a certain amount of followers on Twitter so I can get like my phone out um, have a look and well different screen on my laptop anyway uh, have a look at the questions you guys want to ask me and hopefully answer them over a pretty nice gameplay on whatever game I'll be using so and that's why I use Twitter, is because it's easy to communicate with you guys, and um, it's a pretty good place where a lot of teenagers, a lot of um, adults, I should say, uh, actually spend their time on during computers, like on laptops or whatever. It's either Facebook or Twitter. I think those are two most um, like overpopulated sites that people use. And the reason I use Twitter and Facebook, well, I haven't started a Facebook page yet. But I've started a Twitter account, so if you want to follow me, Twitter link, well not the link, but my Twitter name, I, sh I should say. I'm not quite sure what it's called. Anyway, that'll be on the top right corner right now. So please go and check me out and follow me. And I'll be posting things of what I do and, you know, just what I have for breakfast. I wouldn't really do that, but you know, you get the idea. Anyway, so the reason I use Twitter is because um, a lot of people, as I said, m they might spend their time on their computers, laptops, on the internet I should say, even to make it easier. Uh, they might spend it on Twitter or Facebook because it's um, an easy social network you start to get a grasp of and speak to their friends, family and whatever, etc. To their pets, even though that's not possible. Anyway, so they might not spend their whole time on YouTube, they might not be looking at their subscription page where um, the people that they're subscribed to, like, they're not going to be there, like, 24-7 looking at if this person's uploaded a video, if he hasn't. Uh, they might just be on Twitter. So, if I did upload a video, um, I've got this thing on where it actually sends a message saying, 
um, I've uploaded a new video please check it out and that goes over to my Twitter page and people that are on Twitter at the time can actually look at that tweet and you know go on the link and watch my video that's the way it actually improves it and it does the exact same thing on Facebook even though I might start a Facebook account like I've, I've already got one but that's like for friends and that's for personal stuff but the one for my fans or the one for the people that are interested in me a lot can go spend their time on there as well and it'd be exactly like Twitter but the thing is I'll be using Twitter more often just so I can get a grasp of it and just so I can actually uh, well communicate with you guys much more easier and take your questions and whatever there is you want to ask me anyway as you can see there guys I get my Harriers and this is where I start doing damage and <laughs> get a little bit scared uh, my heart's not pumping but you know towards the end you'll see a big surprise of when I actually get my nuke it should be the last minute possible, last point you should say possible, uh, which is kind of actually ruined the surprise, but I don't really mind. So that's what I want to talk to you guys about: social networking sites, so and that's there, that's gone. That's what I want to talk to you guys about, and that's my main objective done. And I want to go to the second subject of this commentary. Um, the second, su second, uh, I'm having so many tongue twists; it's annoying. The second subject of this commentary is Vestrum and why I've joined Vestrum and why I've always wanted to become a Vestrum director since the beginning. Uh, so, here's a story of how I actually got, well, how I actually noticed Vestrum and what they do. Um, I, I noticed Vestrum by basically going and searching different networks because I wanted to become a director to spread the sort of, to spread my commentaries around the community. That's the, my main objective. I want to get more people entertained by my commentaries and if you are entertained by the way please leave a like and a comment like a positive one if anything because if you're going to leave a negative comment you know all you're going to get is a fish pound of a block well it's actually a click of a block but anyway I think that might put a bit more emphasis on it so <laughs> you guys get the idea and that's what I did and now I've actually kind of lost oh right the restaurant <laughs> kind of got mixed up then I'm getting old I'm not really, I'm only 14 in a couple days anyway. <laughs> so, uh, Vestrum and why I chose to become a Vestrum director. Basically, when I noticed Vestrum, the immediate reaction I had was, um, are they looking for directors? And I searched, I done some research, and they did, they were looking for directors, and they are still looking for directors, if I'm not mistaken. And at first, even though I was looking for directorship, I actually was also looking for partnership for my clan, for my team, A Space. Well, it's Ace actually, not Ace the base, that's just the YouTube. Anyway, that's not what we want to talk to you guys about. So, as soon as I noticed that they were actually recruiting directors and looking for part, well, to partner people, um, I've done a lot more research into it and basically just got contacted, well, I contacted them, Vestrum, for directorship. And if they were kind enough to actually let me have a chance with them and see how you guys at Vestrum will enjoy my commentaries and if you do leave a like uh, just to show them that I am worth being here and you know I don't want to get all cheesy and everything but that's all I want to talk about that's the story of Balamori not really that's the story of why I chose uh, Vestrum or any other network and I also have a lot of faith in them because I think they'll go pretty far and as you can see guys 199 at the bottom left the last possible second to get this nuke and this has been missed guys, or Nathan, and I'm out, peace.